Hi, Matt from Invarian here, and welcome to the tutorial on creating a custom title block in Rapid Plan. The purpose of this tutorial is to make your plan information clear and easy to read for traffic controllers, but also it will help you as a planner to save time in the planning stages. The example I will create today is just one of the ways you can customise a title block. Please just note the plan example I have here in front of me is purely for demonstration purposes and does not depict a real traffic control setup. So, in order to set up a title block, we need to do a few things. Firstly, you will need to select your current print region. To do this, click the printer icon here in the bottom left of your print region. Then, hover over to its properties here on the right hand side and we'll need to click on the Enable Print Frame checkbox. And then we can click Edit. Now, before I continue, it may be worthwhile checking out our print frame video if you are unsure how print frames operate. You can view this video in the description below. Once we are in the print frame editor, come back to the Properties palette and change the current print options from Default to Custom. And then, again, just click Edit. This will bring up another dialog box with our print options. To make room for a title block, we will need to adjust the page margins. The margins you choose to adjust will depend on where you want the title box to, deploy, to display. For this example, I will adjust the right margin and make it 6 centimeters, as I want my block to display on the right hand of my plan. Hit save, and when this is complete, you will see we have made room for our title block. Note that adjusting the print margins will not impede or skew your plan. Rapid Plan will automatically resize the plan print region according to the margins you set. As I start creating the title block, just feel free to pause this video as I go along if I start to go too fast, so that you get to see all of the tools that I'm using. So, from here, I will draw in all the information required to begin with. So I'll mark out some text boxes where I'll enter some plain information. In the top box here, I will add my company logo by simply just adding it from my computer in the insert image option. Then you can just position it as needed within the first box. I'll enter some information here to depict the uh, plan details such as the plan name, author, location and so on. All of your text can also be customised to ensure it is highlighted on the plan, as you can see here. If you are planning on using the title block for future plans, we recommend using text variables for these inputs here. To learn more about text variables, please see the video in the description below. You may also choose to add a comments box, as I've done here. This will give you a chance to add any plan information for the person reading the plan. This could include uh, standard information, uh, it could include information about the controllers, anything that you wanted to include you can put in this comments box here. You can then also add your legend and manifest. Both of these can be customised to fit in your title block, as you can see here.
Finally, you can add the finishing touches by adding a scale marker and a north arrow. And you can feel free to position them wherever you want. If you are ready to print your plan, simply click the edit button next to print options. This will preview your plan for you. You can adjust the margins further if required. And then if you're satisfied, you can go ahead and print your plan or export it to a PDF file. Once you're completely finished, you can then save the print frame template for future use and simply load it onto other plans you complete by clicking the load print frame button in the print frame editor. This will allow you to use the title block in future plans. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Please hit subscribe below to be updated on new content from Invarian.